Dank u wel, voorzitter. Beste collega's, gisteren spraken we... Thank you very much, President colleagues. Yesterday, we were talking about the future of the Jewish community in Europe in light of increasing anti-Semitism. Today, we are talking about the future of Jewish people in their own country. This is what is at stake here. Iran, Hezbollah, Hamas, uh, Islamic Jihad, uh, they all want one thing, which is to wipe Israel off the map. Bearing this in mind, it is very clear on what side we should be in this conflict. We need to defend the survival of the Israeli state. We need to defend the right of Israel to defend itself. When it comes to giving up the fight, uh, Hamas is certainly not uh, willing to do that. They have rejected a ceasefire multiple times. They keep using civilians as human shields. They do not hesitate to use hospitals and schools for their terrorist activities. Blinken is doing his best to reach an agreement. It is laudable achieving uh, the liberation of the hostages and security guarantees for Israel are two of the key conditions uh, for me that need to be answered. Europe is sidelined in all of this. It's not really surprising seeing Europe's attitude. Mr. Borrell sent an official delegation this summer to the inauguration of the uh, Iranian president, and in that way has legitimized that destabilizing regime. Thank you. Would you accept a blue card from colleague Jovanovic? Yes? So please, for 30 seconds, the question. 